What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode with Well Season Uno 64. And uh, thank you so much for stopping by and checking out this video. So, we're gonna talk about this Nissan Pajero. Pajero, you know, models.com Uno 64. So, there it is. There's all the legal stuff that you need to read if uh, you're like a lawyer or something. And let's just push this thing out of its plastic sleeve. That, there you go. Okay, so first of all, the packaging as always, Inno 64 does an amazing job. Let's uh, get a little bit more light here. I think that's better, I hope. Yeah, it's not bad. All right, anyway, so let's just remove it out of the base. Evolution right there, very cool. Now this is a, uh, this wasn't a very popular casting. Like this, especially this one. Uh, this one is kind of easy to find. In fact, this was released in like four different color variations. Uh, this is the only civilian. There you go, we got too much, too much light. This is the only civilian uh, version. I think there's a white one too that has a, um, an extra set of wheels. Now that one is a little bit harder to f uh, find. This one is easier to find, but just uh, seeing it on the base looks amazing. Let me remove it and get this thing out of here. I'm always uh, scared like these these bases will be too tight and they'll like somehow damage the, uh, the axles or the wheels. So let's see how this one fares. Oh, go on. Well, it rolls. Let me... Look at that. It rolls, it rolls. It's not perfect, but... Ooh. Huh. Somehow, the front wheel is a little bit stiff. The rear wheel, check this out. Amazing. So, I may have to open it up and see what's, what's going on. No, I won't. All right, so where should we begin? Let's let's start on this side. Uh, the wheels look amazing. They're, uh, you got some nice off-road wheels, which look fantastic. This is a silver color, which looks really cool. Awesome detail, awesome, awesome job there. Uh, so just check it, check out the front of this car. Man, that looks so good. Look at this, the front hood bonnet. Look at the, look at the, 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 um, let's see if I can get the, without a glare, the interior. Check it out. Look at the detail on the interior. It's so cool. And then you have this, uh, extra side mirror here on the side, which you do already have, a uh, some very, very awesome detail on this. Uh, side and the front check out the rear the exhaust looks amazing rear tail light looks and then you get the extra wheel check it out right there evolution pajero so much detail I, I wonder why this car wasn't this popular you know evolution down there too man this is just a gem wow i can't stop Looking at this, this is awesome. It's not very heavy, it's very light. Very, very light. But the car just looks, wow. Honestly, in 064, to me, they're they're like, they're doing things that everybody should, no should be noticing. <laughs> Man, even the tint on the rear window is different than the front one. Like, who does that? Like, that's attention to detail right there. Look at that. Anyways, I, I'm i in love. Um, yeah, and I I uploaded another video recently where I talked about the Hakatora truck and I said how the paint was a little bit too heavy on that truck. Let me show you what I mean. Look at the lines on the door for this this uh, this Pajero. Well, I said I said Nissan Pajero, right? I'm so sorry. It's a Mitsubishi, Mitsubishi Pajero Evolution. So if you, yes, please correct me in the comments below. Also, you know, I'm so sorry about that. Anyways, 
Let's talk about the paint being a little bit too heavy on the Hakatora truck. Just look at how you lose some of the detail because of the paint. But look at the Pajero and the Hakatora truck. You see that difference? I think they should have done the same as with this Pajero and uh, yeah, I just lovely truck. And you know what? The Hakatora truck is heavier than this one. Kind of weird, right? Kind of weird, but this is just, oh my, I, I don't know what else to say. I hope you guys like it. Let me know what you think. Uh, and um, yeah, I'll see you guys on the next one. So, bye.